there. Fire, danger, and winter-like cold on the way. Meteorologist Barn Morton is here timing out the change. It's hard to believe because today felt like summer. Yeah, in the <laughs> 70s today. We'll be in the 40s tomorrow. You'll need the heavy coat tomorrow, Shelly, and along with that, of course, that really strong wind. You can see the dust blowing in Farmington right now. That's from the camera up there near the San Juan Community College. And, of course, our camera here, the Presbyterian I-25 cam, is shaking in that wind here in Albuquerque. Potentially damaging wind gusts, that extreme fire danger, and a winter-like chill with some snow for parts of the state too. So these are the impacts through the evening. That fire danger very high. Blowing dust, wind damage in a medium category. Power outages are possible this evening. I'll show you that uh, coming up a little bit later in the newscast. But we are looking at tomorrow alert weather with all of those ramping up. Of course, fire danger staying very high. Blowing dust in the high category. Wind damage and power outages looking a little bit more favorable for tomorrow as all of New Mexico, Southwest Colorado, Northeast Arizona and wind advisories, wind warnings as we head through the next 24 hours hours or so with those dangerous wind gusts in the forecast and that extreme fire danger. Don't do anything that would start a spark. Look at these wind gusts right now. 66 in Gallup, 61 in Farmington. That's severe storm strength, 52 in Redoso. So we have the gusty winds right now. We'll continue those through the evening, through dinner time. Overnight, they'll come down a little bit, but they'll ramp up quickly tomorrow morning, and it's going to be an even windier day tomorrow, likely as this powerful front changes into a cold front and sweeps across New Mexico. Check out the wind gust forecast. Now don't focus so much on the actual numbers, but where you see the brown and orange, that's where the winds will be the strongest. Focused over northwest New Mexico this evening, then overnight that will shift into central areas and then through the day on Tuesday that shifts from the central mountains into the eastern part of the state with those strongest wind gusts. We are going to have some snow across the Four Corners region, northwest New Mexico, Durango, Cuba, into areas around Chama, Farmington, Chinle, Gallup and Grants. Could see a light accumulation as we head through tonight into tomorrow, but not a big moisture maker with this one. Alert weather tomorrow giving you the heads up more fire danger, especially the southeastern half of the state tomorrow and much colder temperatures will be in the 40s in Albuquerque, 30s for highs in Santa Fe and in the 50s for Redoso with those super strong winds out there. Some snow showers cross north. Farmington, the four corners, super strong winds. We feel those gusts out there in Gallup and Farmington right now. They will continue tonight into tomorrow with areas of snow and blowing snow. Look at that temperature, 41 tomorrow down to 17 by Wednesday morning. And then we warm up for the end of the week into the Easter weekend. Southwest New Mexico, dangerous wind gusts out there. Areas of blowing dust, Socorro, TRC, and also into Silver City, Lordsburg and Deming. We'll have that strong wind tomorrow that will drop the temperatures with colder air into the low 20s by Wednesday morning. Then we dig out out of it as we head through the next several days after that into the Easter weekend. Same deal, Rodoso, Alamogordo, Roswell, Carlsbad and Hobbs. You're going to have dangerous wind gusts out there. Areas of blowing dust that heightened fire threat as well through tomorrow. I do think that it will chill down as we head into Wednesday and then warm up as we head into Thursday, Friday. Raton, Las Vegas, Northeast New Mexico, Edgewood, Moriarty and Santa Rosa. Dangerous wind gusts, extreme fire danger, dropping temperatures down to 20 by Wednesday morning in Las Vegas. You're back into the 60s by Friday and for Santa Fe, Los Alamos, the northern mountains of New Mexico, strong winds, areas of snow and blowing snow and dust, a 39 high for Santa Fe on Tuesday, down to 20 by Wednesday morning, and then clearing it out as we head through the end of the week. And right here in the metro, Bernalillo, Rear Rancho, Los Lunas, and Blinn, we're going to have those winds that could gust 55 to 65 miles per hour, an alert day tomorrow, and much colder. Look at that, 46 for a high, 25 Wednesday morning, and then we clear it out as we head through the end of the week. Right now, Easter weekend is looking better, only a slight chance of a shower, but the next 24 to 48 hours, it's going to be rough, Shelly.